Hi everybody. In today's video, I'm going to ask a simple request of NVIDIA when they publish a new version of their kit apps to please remove the old ones. Like here for Create, I've got four old versions of Create and that was about 6 gig right there. I think my old versions of Machinima was about 5 gig, so please as you um, uh, publish your updates, give us an option or a prompt or something and just remove the old ones. In the meantime, I wrote a really simple utility called OV Cleaner. This is version 1, so if anything doesn't work, please let me know. And obviously, I don't have every version of every app in, you know, installed, so I'm sure I'm going to miss some things. But most of it was pretty straightforward. Uh, if you have Visual Studio, just clone and run it. You will need Visual Studio set up to have Windows desktop apps enabled. And I also have a, an installer I made thanks to Advanced Installer. It gives me a free license for all my open source projects. So yay, Advanced Installer. Now I'm just going to go ahead and run it. So after you install it, you will get this little woof icon on your desktop for OV Cleaner. The folder should be populated for you. Hopefully that is your folder. If not, browse for the folder where your Omniverse apps are installed. I'm going to click Discover, and this is going to be like the time I levitated and forgot to turn the camera on. You're just going to have to take my word for it this works because I can't clean this twice because I've already removed all my duplicates, but I will show you my final result folder. All of my old versions have zero, you'll notice, but if you had run it and there were old versions found, the checkbox for that app would be selected. Please note the checkbox is for display purposes only in version 1. I should have wrote it to where I don't clean if it's not selected, but for now this is just display. So when you click clean, everything that has a checkbox is going to remove the old versions. And it should show you a, a rough guesstimate of how much it tries to delete, but that's not accurate at all. I, don't, I did a little bit of testing, but at least it gives you some idea of what you're deleting. And that is really all there is to it, so I can't show you the cleaning, obviously. But the one thing I will show you, though, I'll leave you with at the end of this video is where the woof came from. I'm Winston Wolf. I solve problems. All right, thanks for watching.